Good evening, everybody. Well, let's see here. Things are a little turned down there. There we go. Welcome to tonight's stream. God, is the music louder or is it just me? <laughs> I really cannot tell. Um, I could have swore I turned it down. It's just really loud on my end. Can you guys even hear it? I need to make sure. Now that I have it down to two. It just seems so damn loud. But welcome to tonight's stream. We're going to be playing a lot of games. Probably about a half hour with each one. Um, so three or four games will get shown tonight. Uh, these are a bunch of games that I have been given codes for, so, like this game, uh, a robot named Fight. B.O. Kirby, welcome to the stream. Uh, this was given to me free from the developers. Uh, so this will be the first one up. We'll see how, I'm gonna try to stick to a half hour. We'll see how hooked I get into this. <laughs> um, I'm gonna give it a little bit of time before I talk about my lovely new piece of information that I want to give to everybody. Um, let's see, what else? Let's just first cheer the stream. Why? Thank you. I appreciate that, B.O. Kirby. God of Knockers, welcome to the expedition where we are always in search of hidden gems and giving them their time in the spotlight. Glad to have you aboard. Uh, um, let's see, where was I? Oh, yes. We can kind of look at what we got planned potentially for tonight. Hey, Biff McSkylark. <laughs> Biff knows what my big news is. Because he got the same thing I did. <laughs> um... So I guess that as we're getting more and more people in here, I am going to let, uh, so tonight on the docket, what we have lined up potentially is this game, uh, Tangle Deep, Time Recoil, Bot Like, a Robots Rampage, and maybe some Eldritch. We will honestly see how things go. <laughs> Biff, I think they finally, uh. Because they were, like, setting it up, so I think we finally got... They finally just decided to launch it. But, um, with that, I'm going to announce now, I am now a Humble Bundle partner. Uh, there is a link down in my info panels, and I will be putting one up in my Discord. For all purchases on Humble Bundle, if you use my link, you support my channel. Uh... Not only my channel, Charity, and Humble. Uh, all three things are amazing. <clears throat> and this is honestly the... I now have the if two affiliates or partnerships that I wanted out of all this, which is with IndieBox and now Humble. So, yeah, the, the link's down there. I will put more links up in Discord. I'm fucking excited. I I love Humble Bundle. <laughs> and <laughs> nice, Biff. This was just like the two that I wanted was Indie Box and Humble, and I'm in both of them now, so. Hell yeah. <laughs> but we're all here to play games. Like I said, we're going to be going about a half hour or so with each one, depending how hooked I get. So let's just dive into this. Let's. I've been told this game's amazing. I know, Biff. That's so funny. That like the timing. I <laughs> I have heard nothing but amazing things about this game. So I'm a huge Metroid fan. I love roguelikes. You all know that. This is supposed to be stand up. Thank you. This ow fuck. Okay, 
problem number one, I am playing with a joystick in a game that's very clearly supposed to be. Yes, Biff, I did watch the video, man. I I totally understand your your predicament. I, I, I get why you're doing what you're doing, and I commend you for going as long as you have. Evil Empire Games, thank you for the host, buddy. Because damn, man, you've been going... You're going to be going up to 600 days? That's fucking amazing. I think I would be sick of video games after a while, which is hard to say. Square to shoot. X to jump. R2 to... Oh, God, I'm dying. Press buttons. Everything is going dark. <laughs> uh, can I shoot? Ah, I can shoot that. Okay, this is going to take some getting used to. Ooh. Okay, so apparently I can't shoot them all. Just some. Just some. Okay. This is very Super Metroid-esque. A BRB, no problem. very for having 80 frames per second it's very janky right now and i'm really confused how that's happening it's got to be the controller again i'm gonna try something <sighs> um settings controls Settings, what, what are they again for keyboard update? Like, that should be. It should be working. And it's not. Back to title. <sighs> it's because I pulled the damn freaking cord. It fucked everything up. I did. I fucked it all up. <clears throat> this game hates me. How do I tell it I'm in keyboard? Just one keyboard. So we need DualShock 4, remove. Done. It's still not doing anything. Okay, this game is really starting to irritate me. <sighs> Hold on real quick, everyone. We're just gonna we're just gonna fresh start it. Not a good way to start off the night. Having all kinds of issues like that. The other thing this game does that really pisses me off is it opens up when you're not in full screen. It opens up in a really weird resolution. It opens the resolution I want and then it bounces around and it pisses me off. <laughs> Did it actually work? Oh my god, it opened in the resolution I wanted. There's a god. Alright. Press any key. Enter. Let's try this again. So Penta, the issues I was having just now is I pulled my PS I pulled my PS4 controller out because it was slowing the game down and I had to reboot the game because it could not re recognize my keyboard. And the big announcement: I am now a humble bundle partner. Uh, okay, I'm having to play this with keyboard. This is not as easy as I would hope it is. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. That thing, like, unleashes little dudes at me. Okay, we're not... How are you doing tonight, Penta? Uh... 
No. Okay, we don't. Phoenix Growl. Oh, they turned you down? I'm sorry to hear, buddy. Oh, I'm hoping it I'm hoping it does well. I got the new link on my Oh crap, those are like eggs. That's what those are. Oh crap. Oh crap. Mouse cursor on screen. My bad. I'm a professional, I swear to god. Rusted evil, welcome. So for everyone just coming in, I know Penta, you heard it. Uh, the big announcement is Humble Bundle has accepted me as a partner with them. So any and all Humble Bundle purchases used on my with my link, which is down below, and I will be posting it in Discord, supports the channel. Um, you can choose up to there's like a slider, much like you can when you choose like the charity you want to give it to. You can choose how much you want to support the channel. I believe it's up to 15% is what it said. And then um, if you sign up for Humble Monthly using my link, uh, it kicks me $10. Does this mean I'm famous now? Hardly. Hardly. <laughs> Dude. Okay, Penta. Check your email, buddy, because I filled that app out seven fucking months ago. <laughs> it took them seven months, and they finally got back to me and Biff McSkylark. Okay. So now we do fire damage. Yeah, because, like, Biff can attest. We sent in those... I know we both sent in our Humble Bundle... Uh, partnership apps it was like six or seven months ago like they are slow <laughs> Ooh, these guys burn motherfucker oh no 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 ow <laughs> yeah, I think I sent mine in just... I sent mine in before I met you, Biff, and then I sent another one in, like, just shortly after I met you. <laughs> okay, well, what good did that do? That did nothing. Rusted Devil, thank you for the host. Okay, is the sound on this? Like, it, everything just sounds so loud to me, so if it is... If it is god awful loud on your guys' end, can someone let me know? God, it is so loud on my side. That is weird. God damn it, Rusted. <laughs> Playing this with a keyboard is not easy. Not easy at all. Ah! Oh my god. Of course he does. Of course he does. Why wouldn't you? Yeah. Tri Orb has been unearthed and will appear in future playthroughs. Okay, so I just started using a uh, chatty because it takes up less memory than Chrome, and fuck do I love it. <laughs> yeah, definitely. It's like... Okay, hold on. We are gonna have... I have to rebind these. This is killing me. Controls. Okay. 
Okay, so attack. How do I want to do this? Place, press a key. Uh, control. Jump. Special move is L. Fucking hell. We'll do special move. I'm trying to make this so that my hands aren't like right next to each other. Activated item. Why not E? Why would that be U? Why not E? Come on now. Angle up. We'll have that as up. Look down. Okay, the rest of that's good. This will take a little bit of adjusting, but it's going to be so much better in the long run. Oh, yeah. Evil Empire Games, how you been, man? What have you been playing lately? Oh my god, this game is... This game is fun. <laughs> Mouse on the game again. My bad. Okay, so as long as I don't fuck with those, they don't hurt me. Bright shell has been unearthed and will appear in future playthroughs. Okay, so it's definitely, it's got some like, it's like a roguelite Metroid. I like that. I must construct meat destroying orbs for you. Death to the meat, Mega Beast. Maybe a misfortune thing for the host. Um, you must find more archaic scrap. Oh, oh, because I'm. Yeah, gotcha. Okay, you can't help me. Officially hosted you playing more times than I've gone live myself. <laughs> well, I appreciate the support there, bud. I'm digging the music too. It's it's got like a true Metroid vibe as far as music goes. I love it. I played a stupid amount of Metroid as a kid. Oh crap, no. Got double jump. Nice. You. It's a little late to tonight's game. I, I was a. Uh, I was watching Miracle. God, I forgot how much I love that movie. Such a good movie. To be fair, Empire, Evil Empire, you are more of a YouTuber than Twitch, too, so that's okay. Ow! No? Okay. I was like, there's got to be something around here I can do. 
Oh shit. There we go. BRB, you gotta deal with little brother, no problem, Phoenix Crawl. Ow! The fuck? So that does not open. I do love that this thing's running like at a solid 120 frames. Okay, I don't think I can become a ball yet. No, I cannot. Unless that's what. Nope, that is not what that does. No, no sticky keys. No. <sighs> All because I wasn't paying attention. And I hit the stupid freaking restart. Ow. Ow. That's what I get for not paying attention. This is supposed to be randomly generated, correct? I think so. So far, it's not appearing to be, uh, kinda. Yeah, it's random. It's random. What's this? Got rocket launcher. Press... What? Anyone got an idea what those are? Anybody? <laughs> I, I, have, I have no fucking clue what that is. <laughs> is that a period and a comma? Maybe that's what that is. It is. Okay. I'm, I've just been kicking over my uh, my streams, but I realized I I realized I was breaking some terms of service though, so I had to I, I had to correct that. I can't kick them over till 48 hours, so they're not gonna go up immediately after. I was doing it immediately after streams, and that's not okay. So I want to make sure I got that taken care of. Because the Twitch, the Twitch VOD player is horrible, so that's why I have YouTube. Is I'll put my streams up there. They're they're not edited or anything. It's just straight copy of my stream over to that. But but yeah, I have to wait 48 hours before I'm allowed to do that.
Uh, to put it on YouTube, yes. So as an affiliate, you sign up um, saying you agree that for like Twitch has rights to your video for the first like I think it's 48 hours. It could be 24 hours too. It's one of those two. Either way, for the first few out like at least the first day minimum after your stream, Twitch has rights to your video. It is theirs essentially. Um, after that, you can do with it as you please. But they don't want you to just push it to a to a competitor. You got shoot orb, an orb that shoots. Ooh, I like that. Very literal on the naming. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Oh my god, I just want out of here. That's all I want. One way of doing that. Big Bolt has been unearthed and will appear in future playthroughs. Okay. I'm definitely seeing that this game can become a. We're, we're going to be playing more of this on stream. Oh my god. I don't know how to open that. Oh, shit. No, no, no. Oh, fuck, it's dark. Oh, no, 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 no. And I'm dead. <sighs> All right. Let's figure out what our next game's going to be. So we're gonna try another. It's called a bot like a robots rampage. This was another key I actually got given by the developer this morning. Um, I do apologize for anybody's ears. I have not booted this thing up yet. I'm hoping it does not go up loud. Option, really? No options? Start a new game. What the hell? Okay, well, that's unfortunate. I'm going to try booting it one more time. It wouldn't let me select anything. I couldn't open anything. Ah, there we go. Give me just one second here. Woo. Main menu. Yep, we aren't going to play that one. All right. And now I can't close it. Great. OK. It 
it wouldn't give me options. It's stuck in some crazy resolution. Um, so yeah, we will move on to the next game. <laughs> that sucks. Is that one actually looks really cool? So that's called um, Bot Like a Robot's Rampage. It looks awesome. I think like I think it has a lot of potential. We will have to try it another day. So next up we will try is called Time Recoil. Let's get this thing set up here. Display. I'll put that back there so you guys at least have something to look at. Where'd the game go? I'm digging the music. Until I click off this game. <laughs> Tesla Lovecraft. All right. So let's capture window time recoil. Boom. Where's phone? Need to change games. We are now into time recoil. Go into story, normal. 1988. If I've found assault rifle, you can shoot through thin walls and doors with assault rifle. is like Hotline Miami. I need more ammo. Some time ago, 1981. All right, I'm digging this game. I'm in prison. Oh shit! Did you receive our message? You must now come with me if you want to live. In the future, you may yet redeem yourself by killing everybody. This is what I understand. sacrificed his life to rescue you. Returning to your original timeline is usually deadly. It's a one-way trip. Except maybe for you. You look fine. The director says that you are somehow special. That you do not die when you return. Okay. Welcome to our humble base. I'm glad your retrieval was a success. It cost us a good man, though you'd better be worth it. Go get a good night's sleep. You're going to need it. You've got a busy day tomorrow. Oh, before you go, look outside. This was Paris. We existed to prevent this.
Calculate temporal vectors. Engage space-time navigator. Activate main power. Engage test sequence. Oh shit. Back in 1987. Ah, oh, damn it. So you're the defector from the past. Call me Marcus. Regarding your health, it seems your body has no signs of temporal lesions. This means the director may be right. You might be able to come back. Oh, good lord, everyone. Hold on real quick. Sorry about that, everyone. Just a wicked case of heartburn. I had to go grab some tones. Oh. oh my god! Look how cute it is! <laughs> Rested, how's your day going, man? I was wondering why it's so quiet. I was like, Rested was here a second ago. Come on now. Oh my god, the heartburn's killing me. Chrono Compass is a device which tracks the wormhole signature from the place of origin. This device sits on the user's wrist. The user can recreate the wormhole he used to arrive at the device with the push of a button. In the future, we hope to improve the device so that the user could jump in time without visiting the place of origin in person. However, the origin would still need to power the wormhole, even though the user would skip it between other destinations. Good lord, Rusted. A tropical depression made it? You gonna be alright? Alexa is the supergirl we brought back from the past to help us stop Mr. Time. She was once the lead scientist of Mr. Time's temporal science team. In a failed experiment, she was exposed to rogue temporal currents. This may have given her superpowers. The experiment would have been her final task as she was about to resign. Not sure if it was an accident after all. After refusing to help him with temporal weapon, Mr. Time imprisoned her in 1974. She was subject to cruel experimentation. The events come back to her as dreams and flashbacks. The experiments lasted over for a year. Afterwards, she was forgotten in a facility called Section 19, where we located her. Good lord, man. Between you guys and Florida, just getting hit with hurricanes and shit. Well, that's good. That is good that you're all right. I hope you were rested. What you told us about Mr. Time was astonishing and horrifying. I can now understand your hatred. Terrible stuff. If you want to re That stuff needs to go away. Go away. <laughs> if you want to re review my notes, they're on the table. Our first task is to verify my theory. So far, nobody has survived the return trip. I believe your incident granted you protection from the quantum effects of time travel. You said you're ready to take the leap, so no reason to postpone things. Go and talk to Dr. Magnuson next. Alright, I just want to go shoot things. Okay, to prove you can change the past without dying, we will do an experiment. Before joining the group, I worked in a company that worked for Mr. Time. Your task is simple. Steal from the past me. You will arrive at the office I worked at, grab the intel folders in my room, I should remember that I lost something. Also, here's your chrono compass. Just hit the red button when you want to return and be careful, wormholes are destructive. Sweet. 
I think this game could end up being a lot of fun. Oh, we do have a gun. Okay, be careful. Phoenix Hero. How you doing, buddy? Space is melee. Hold E and escape. <clears throat> Playing this weird, like, time traveling hotline Miami. I'm loving it. A success. You say you stole from the past Magnus and verifies, and you're alive. You're kind of superhero. Or a weapon. I was playing a robot name fight. Uh, I got a number of games I want to push through tonight, so I'm, I'm sticking to around a half hour or so a game. I was not bad rested. I liked it. I think I would be playing more of it. Um, it's brutal on keyboard. It really is. I need to just suck it up and buy like an Xbox controller or something that I can actually like operate on the PC without having that weird input lag. Because it was running at like 80 frames per second. 80, to, it, it would bounce 80 to 100. And uh, with the PS4 controller in there, it would act like it was running at about 40. So, um, it's brutal on keyboard, man. <laughs> All right. Now we can start gathering intel. The first target is a temporal party branch office. You need to move around in the building this time, so pay attention to your environment. I wish we could send you with heavier weapon, but the scientists tell me that metal objects larger than a small pistol cause too much quantum disturbance. Whatever that is, your special abilities more than make up for this limitation, though. Good luck. It is fun. Um, I will be playing more of it. I wanted to play another game, but it didn't have any... It's still in early access. It had zero options. None at all. And it was not... It was not working on my end. I could not get the resolution right. Nothing. So that's why we switched to this. Killing gives you slowdown time. Gauge shows slowdown you're in. Input lag on Hollow Knight is so infuriating. Uh, the input lag is just frustrating. Oh god! Level complete. Exit via the elevator. So no, no creating a weird temporal shift and leaving that way. Dude, this music. I fucking love it. Me move dash. Kills and slowdown grant special moves. Two kills give you dash. Dash through enemies and walls. Oh man. Okay. Fucking hell, I love this game. I, I'm in love. <laughs> it's like Hotline Miami meets Time Cop. I'm fucking loving it. Okay, this mission will require guts. We must prevent their murders. The intel contained kill lists for people who could have helped us. Were they alive? The orders originate from the Temporal Police. If we kill the ones who gave the orders, the murders may be prevented. Go there and kill all the targets, then history will somehow change. We can observe that, or you can. Go 
Dashing in walls. You can dash through thin walls. Kill two enemies to gain dash. Dash through the wall here. I know. Oh, damn it. Dang, Phoenix. <laughs> so, okay, it's been a few days of the Twi Twitch extensions on my uh, my stuff. What do you guys think of them? What's your guys' opinion? Oh, boy. Damn it. Getting hard. You like them? I won't lie, it is a little depressing to not see you guys winning and losing. Ah, fuck me. <laughs> Rusted loves Stream Legends. He's been addicted. destruction you do in this game. No, oh, I finished the game too for the match. Was that not sick? It was amazing. Yeah, I'm hoping... It's still in beta, so I'm hoping that's coming. And I'm fairly certain that there's going to be a lot of people that's what they're going to be saying. Wall types. You can destroy thin walls. You can't destroy thick walls. I'm going to assume these are thick walls right here. They look a lot thicker. Reinforced. Boom. Okay, this game, this game's fucking awesome. <laughs> really? We did not observe any changes. You really haven't seen Major Dunhill before? We recruited the Major a few moments, months ago. It's hard to wrap your head around this time travel stuff. This is awkward. He has your next mission. Okay. So, you remember another timeline? That is interesting. We met when you arrived. In any case, we have a genocide to prevent. I've discovered something more we can change. In 1985, Mr. Time targeted New York with an experimental weapon. It was supposed to freeze time. The experiment failed, but the United States is still about to be defeated. They may give up at any time now. We can prevent this. Go there and destroy the site. Dude, I'm I'm time cop. That this is what that game is. It's time cop. <laughs> All right, shoot gas cylinders to make them explode. Man, 
I did not realize there was dudes in here. <laughs> Hell yeah. Out of here we go. <laughs> the pixel bot's feeling left out. Oh my god, frame rate just dropping. I'm so glad it goes slow mo. Oh no. Damn it. Mm -hmm. Oh, I thought I thought he was dead. I couldn't see him. Boom, bitches. Nope, that that did not do it how I wanted it. I'm stuck. What is going on? Okay. What? There we go. Two targets remaining, seriously. Level complete. <sighs> oh shit, you guys found El Dorado. Hell yeah. Fucking hell, I'm loving this game. Alright. The newspaper is verifying your story. You seem to have saved New York, and the United States is still resisting Mr. Time unlike in your previous timeline. Your powers open new possibilities. We can bring in people from the past without always losing someone. The rebellion can grow. We already have the first target, a potential defactor. You'll arrive at the Temporal Party main HQ. Find an officer who knows the answer to the word chrono with death. Go. Dude, bot's not fucking afraid of nothing. <laughs> If I knew enough programming, I'd just program my own fucking bot. Or, like, extension. Uh, what the hell? You! You disappeared years ago. Somehow you... It's the incident. You travel in time. If you can do this, you're too dangerous to let live. Kill her now! <sighs> Shit. <laughs> Rigged. <laughs> Damn 
Death. Don't shoot. He's already gone. You won't find him here. I'm part of a cabal, a cabal with a goal to kill him. I'll go with you. You must know something if you discovered me too. Oh, do I gotta capture you? Okay. Shit. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Yep, that's one way of killing a guy. <laughs> Chapter 1. 1987. What are you guys thinking of this game? Holy cow. That's not good. And now he knows more. We must go back further and quickly. Disconnected. What the hell? Chatty disconnected for a second. That was weird. We still can't go past Paris Day, and that means we can't prevent the deaths, and now this. The defector here gave us some very valuable information. He knows where Mr. Time held some rebellious scientists. The science teams mostly work in former Soviet science labs, which Mr. Time took over. It seems they're all in various Eastern Bloc countries. Expect icy weather. If he speaks the truth, this will help both him and us. These scientists can help us travel further into the past. Go fetch them. I do like it. It's yeah. There's a story to it. I'm not just a mass murderer. <laughs> okay, four slowdown shots kills Grant's dash blast. Really? Oh, damn it! I think I just totally wasted that dash blast. <laughs> oh, come on. Scientist. Damn it. Loving it. Excellent work. The scientists were very confused but thankful. They were kept in appalling conditions. In fact, they already have an idea where to go next. Go talk to them. Hey, Mr. Scientist. Sergey. Hello, my name is Sergey. Our group was imprisoned after we spoke against the leader. What he did in Paris was unforgivable. I'm glad to help take him down. Before you captured us, I was in a meeting with a high-ranking officer. He carries an encryption key. It can decode a lot of intel you've collected previously. So, you should eliminate him and take the key. Don't shoot me, though. You know paradoxes. <laughs> Sounds like my grandpa. That's honestly what it is. <laughs> Other games on the docket. Um, what else do we have? I'd gone over this earlier, but I don't even remember now. Um, Tangle Deep. That will start here probably in a few minutes. And then... Possibly Ernog. Ah, oh, damn, I could have just gotten through this.
there, but nope, I fucked that one up. Oh! Oh no! <laughs> That's why we're doing this, man. I got a lot of games to show off. I'm not surprised it has looked. It has looked like time travel is possible. This all sounds strange, but I will try to imprison myself also. Okay. Out of old wormhole to escape. Winter sale. Winter sale. Winter sale. Well, you're really gonna hate the fact that I'm gonna post the link to the. I'm gonna repost the link to the. Uh, end of summer sale on Humble now that I'm <laughs> partnered with them. <laughs> wormhole generator. We created the wormhole generator, or the time machine. After capturing some top secret research data from Mr. Time, the heart of the machine are the chronoscopes. At the moment, we can go back in time six years. Paris was destroyed in 1978, so currently we can't prevent that. Also, Alexa had no contact with Mr. Time during the time frame we can reach with our current equipment. The furthest we can go was 1980. However, we're working on improvements as more information is arriving with the help of our new friend. We hope to travel back 10 or more years, which would help us prevent the destruction of Paris and kill Mr. Time. Yeah, Rusted, I do. I'm okay with that. <laughs> I think I can live with that. <laughs> <laughs> the decryption key of <laughs> Ooh, all the shadow runs. Shadow runs a good game. I just don't have the time to invest in it right now. That's really all it is nowadays. I just don't have the time. Uh the decryption key unveiled the location of the warehouse housing high quality superconductors. These are vital components for the improved wormhole generator. You'll find them inside the wooden storage crates. If you succeed, we're one step closer to extending our range. Alright, I think this will be the last mission, and then we'll switch it up to another game. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda sad. I really like this game. Damn it. I got this morning was for the game I tried to play that had no settings or anything. It's called Bot Like something, something, something. Um, exit. Let's see. God, I do love the soundtrack. The soundtrack of this game is phenomenal. Okay. Let's see real quick what the game was called because I'm forgetting. Bot Like a Robot's Rampage. I can totally play it on my own. <laughs> But I couldn't set any of the volume, nothing. It had zero options, and for the stream, I needed to make it smaller and lower resolution, just so that it would run a little better. And it wasn't an option, so we just, I just didn't play it. So, 
Let's see, what do we have here? It is in early access still. It's uh, It's been being made for a while. The game looks awesome. It really does, but uh, yeah. Uh, I hadn't opened it yet to see and prepare to make sure that it was gonna work right. Yeah, so it's my bad. All right, let's switch over to that. We'll close time recoil. We are going to try out Tangle Deep, which is a JRPG-ish, with a JRPG with like roguelike elements. Um, oh, sweet. Thank you. Windowed. Thank you. Resync on play. Games, dashboard, so now this has been out for a while in early access, uh, first time setup, please select your preferred control style, WASD, keyboard, mouse, new game. How's this show up? Well, it'd help if I did this. There we go. Now you all can see what I'm seeing. Slot one. For untold generations, why people here live deep within the earth, surrounded by verdant subterranean forests, sparkling waters, and crystalline luminance. We all have special connection to this world, a bond with nature we call the touch. Some are born with an abundance of touch, which fills them with the sense of adventure and urge to explore the wilds beyond our home. Those with extra touch can even inherit the appearance of animals. And sometimes when we fully experience the touch, we are drawn to Tangle Deep, an ever-changing labyrinth that leads upward to a world that no one has ever seen. I've never felt the touch. Unlike many others in my home of Riverstone Camp, there's so much I want to learn about Tangle Deep. Today, I've decided I will go there and find my own answers. Select which game mode to play. This cannot be changed once the game has started. Heroic, if you reach zero HP, the game ends. Permadeath, only banked goods and town progress will be saved. This is challenging, but also the intended way. Well, if that's the intended way, that is what we shall do. What is your name? Vlad. Oh my god. Look at them all. It's, uh... RPG with roguelike stuff? I, I, I'm not 100% sure. <laughs> um, it, it, it calls itself an RPG, and then they talk about how they use roguelike elements. So, hold on here real quick. I'm loving the graphics. The graphics look amazing. The music music is awesome i'm really digging this cloak dude but honestly we're gonna go with my my ooh, what do we got Ooh, a gambler a risk taking fortunes a risk taking fortune seeker specializing in outlandish attacks with a pinch of luck mixed in basic abilities plus 10 chance of crit with abilities improved spirit energy stamina wild cards only draw from two suits Bio Kirby, pull for what? That was uh that was just saying what the game is. Well, I normally go for like a rogue. And I'm thinking the gambler is probably the closest. We do have what looks like a monk. I do like monks. When I play DD, I'm often a monk or a rogue. We're going to go with the gambler. Slick job. Slick two starting feats. Oh, man. So this is kind of like Adam almost. Okay, so this is going to be roguelike. This is going to be like true roguelike. Okay. 
Start with extra HP, gain more each level. Quick step, take an instant one squared move before enemies react. Oh, I like that one. <sighs> Keen eyes examining enemies reveals more detailed information. Intimidating. Uh, it, uh, most roguelikes tend to have RPG elements, so um, think of Caves of Cud, think of Adam. Um, there are turns, there's tiles, there's permadeath, there's random generation. Uh, most roguelikes have some kind of level system. Um, so, I mean, they, they are. RPG, it, this should be more of this should be, they should call this a roguelike with RPG elements as opposed to an RPG with a couple roguelike elements because as it seems right now it seems to be setting up almost like as if I was playing a Ancient Domains of ma uh, Mastery, Mystery, Mastery, Mystery, I cannot remember, Adam, that's what I call it, Adam, A-D-O-M. Uh, monsters are much less aggressive, no. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Heal more when you use your flask. Earn more money from enemies. Sell items for more profit. Find more and better loot. Ooh. We're going to go scavenger. Finished. It's loading. So this is another one just for everybody. I'm trying to do things. Oops, whoops. I'm trying to do things more by the the book, more by the, uh, the way that FTC wants me to do stuff. Um, when I was in PAX, I went to a lot of what is fair use panels, stuff like that, uh, and so. With that in mind, I got this game for free. Much like the other two games that I played tonight, I got them for free. <laughs> okay, so this is weird. This is not turn-based right here. You automatically pick up the items by walking over them. Equipment will be auto-equipped in in, to any empty slots. Press I for consumables and Unassigned for your equipment, careful changing gear in the dungeon takes a turn. <laughs> okay, is there a way that I can change? No, not full screen mode. Why isn't that switching back? Hold on, I'm sorry. Everything is a little weird right now. There we go. Ha ha, so much better. So much better. Yeah, Rusted, you, you are lucky and get a lot of games from us. <laughs> that is very true. God, just look at that art style. I I'm in love. It is so good. Okay, so it is very turn-based. It's Though you cannot see the tiles, it is very obvious I am moving one tile at a time in the way I move. Today's the big day. I'm so excited for you, honestly. You know, it's dangerous up there. Amazed that no one's seen the end of, but there's so much to learn. I know you'll go far, and I know you've prepared for so long, but if you'd like some basic starter advice, I'm happy to help. Eh, what advice? Eh, Phoenix, I mean, it's... The movement is very much... A true roguelike's gonna have you on a grid because it is turn-based. When you move, everybody else shifts a tile as well. So it's. I just like that you don't see the grid. I'm okay with that. Press F1 for controls basic help. You can return to the camp by using your escape portal, but it takes a few turns to activate. I can understand that. Uh, remember your life is precious. If your health reaches zero, you must re begin a new adventure from the very beginning. That is how a roguelike works. You can help choose those starting adventures by visiting the banker and storing items for future use. Thanks, Julia. Off for an adventure. Huh? 
Tangle Deep is turn-based, so monsters only move when you do. Take your time planning your next action. Yeah, this is this is a straight up roguelike. I, I really don't know why they don't advertise it as such. Like they mention the roguelike elements, but I mean this is a roguelike. You can move diagonally by pressing two directions at once for more precision. Hold left shift to restrict your movement to only diagonals. Need to pass time, space will pass time. Okay. Treasure! Spiritual spectacles. Oh, I'm wearing them. Plus five guile, plus five sweetness, plus five ten spirit, plus two core stats. Okay. That hurts. I can't do anything about that. Well, it kind of makes sense for me in an advertising standpoint. There are more people who like RPG. That's true. Rogues turn off a lot of people. Once you reach the stairs, press keypad to enter, click on yourself to proceed. You did find all three treasures on the ground, didn't you? If not, try looking for the wall. Okay, hold on. I think I only found two. Or did I get... No, I got three. The apple was the other one up there. Yeah, we got them all. Entering the Follies, the safest area of Tangle Deep was still dangerous. Yeah, I did not read that fast enough because I'm just not paying attention. I'm like looking at all of the uh, beautiful artwork. I like it. I like it a lot. You need to heal. Drink from your flask by clicking on it or pressing on a sign. Where's my flask? You have enough job points to learn a new skill. Wild cards. Roll the bones, cost to learn 75 or 100, hot streak. So we got both these now, what do they do? It's a passive, uh, draw a card every time you crit or at random when you kill a monster. Active, play your current hand, the better hands mean better effects. Toss your magical dice and let them fall where they may. Get one of four random effects. Double down. Spend 10% of your max health. If you take at least this much damage within three turns, attack with a fire blast that hits all adjacent foes. Oh, that's kind of cool. Okay. Oh, there's a giant gold chest. <laughs> You've opened a Pandora's box. These special chests give you lots of experience, JP, and gold, but all monsters in Tangle Deep become a little harder. Of course. Because I can't have good things. My greed, this is what it is. Especially the ones on this floor. Think carefully when you see these. Fucking game. Ooh, swords. I don't know if I can... Can I have swords? I guess I can. Weapon. Are these equipped? I don't... So what's this do? Weapon power 150, 175, 145, 170. Why do we want to go 175? Chance to stun your target. I like the chance to repost and parry. Ranged weapons. Once ranged weapons can be fired by clicking on your target or pressing F. What is with the random lightning strikes? I don't like that. 
don't like that at all. Which have positive and negative effects. Water drains your stamina, but allows you more easily dodge rain's attacks. Lava hurts you, can hurt most, most monsters. Mud can reach you in place. Certain terrain may enhance or decrease your elemental damage too. Great. Oh, we're in mud. Equip that in offhand. Dude, we leveled up. Shit. Okay. Um, strength, swiftness. A critical hit. Filled flask, okay. Streamlabs hate me right now, but the bot loves me. <laughs> so did I forgot to ask Penta, and I don't know if he's still in here. I don't think he is. Did he switch all the way to Streamlabs? Or the the extension? Is that not where I came to There's a map. This place is a gold mine. In the last two weeks, I've picked up over a dozen swords, axes, and chest plates scattered in the caves. A little sharpening for ca caves, calves, caves. A little sharpening for the weapons, a little patchwork for the armor, and they're good as new. If I can just keep out of the way of the monsters, I'll be set for life. Okay, so he still has his bot. I lost all my freaking money on that freaking bot of his. Nope, that's Riverstone Camp. Okay. Jelly Grotto. I hope they go that way. You found a side area. Side areas are marked with the treasure chest icon in the upper left next to the area name. Side areas can have extra rewards, challenges, characters to meet. Once you're done here, go back the way you came to return to the main dungeon path. Ooh, we got cow drops. Um, let's heal. Magic portal. Okay, so we need to use these things. I keep forgetting I have these. A pretty, pretty ribbon. I like the pretty, pretty ribbon. Um, while in the dungeon, equipping items in the use of turn. However, switching weapons on your hotbar is free. If you plan on changing gear, go back town's best. Okay. Oh, dude, the giveaway function was easy. You got to do it on a. You can only activate it from Streamlabs. Like you have to have your stuff open on Streamlabs to get the giveaways to work, but it's really easy. Oh, fuck off. Um, two. I just fucked that guy up by using all those cards. is not working for attacking. Oh shit. Oh shit. Side area cleared. Go back the way you came. The rest of the dungeon is for shortcut. Okay. Well, I'm gonna get this. Oh, damn.
Okay, that was not quite how I expected that to go. My bad. Um, just for the sake of wanting to get one more in here. That's why we're going to call it with that game. I do like that. We will be... I'll be mixing Tangle Deep in into future streams. I like the look of that. It's a uh, very reminiscent of Adam. Which all right, now that I'm actually looking here, let's see what that's called. Because it's driving me insane. Ancient Domains a Mystery. Oh dude, Sprogear Wood, such a good roguelike. It is three bucks. Um so it's very reminiscent of Adam, even Caves of Cud in some ways, but a much nicer UI compared to those that uh, I think for it, it's easier to chew on, <laughs> for lack of better terms. All right. What are we playing next? Let's see. Let's go to Ernog. I was messing around with Ernog earlier. I really liked it. It is a Humble Store exclusive. And I believe you can go on there and you can buy it from them. I got it in... So this one I did not get free. I got it in the Humble Month old Monthly. Which is amazing. If you've not signed up... like, And this is aside from the fact that I am a partner now humble bundle monthly is amazing it is 12 bucks a month for enough games that are typically over a hundred dollars worth of games i love humble monthly sprogy wood is it's close it's got some stuff that'll carry over um it is i'd say it's like 99 percent roguelike with like one percent roguelite because you do unlock certain things for other playthroughs, but otherwise it's it's as close to a roguelike you can get. <laughs> um, what was I going to do? That's right. Ernog. Changing games, and here I just start talking and I forget. Nog. Come on. There we go. Game has been updated. Okay, resolution. Sprogy Wood is so much fun. It, it's simple, but it's can be incredibly complex too. Launch. All right, this game, this game is adorable. I love it. It is a lot of fun to play. I don't quite know what it is. I've only played for a little bit. Oh my god! Look how cute it is! <laughs> Alright, so file B, erase file. Sh change character. I just want that guy with the beard. It needs to be red. I guess not, so I'm stuck with that. That's as close as I can get. taking so long. Load. <laughs> this is killing me. <laughs> oh my god, there's load. <laughs> I don't know why it's taking so long. Maybe I just wasn't paying attention the last time. <laughs> you guys <laughs> oh there we go there we go there we go the last like 20 percent <laughs> jump jump Oop. carry at him Shit. 
item while carrying it. Remember, every item can be used. Ah, <laughs> that's awesome. Wait. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, he can shoot three. That's cool. Enter door. Triangle. Small doors won't fit items. Big doors do, though. You like Kirby in a sense. It seems like it. Ah, this is just the beginning. Humble original. Ernog. Remember, every item can be used. Oop, there's a key. Save room. This room remembers everything. You will always find the save room the way you left it. Wait, wait, wait. What's that down there? Hmm. Oh, oh. What the? sounds when doing things. <laughs> Read. How to win. Collect the items shown on the display. Put them in the device underneath. Okay. So we gotta find all those other... What the fuck do I use this on? Where's A? Next Machina's got another amazing soundtrack. There, that's H. There's A. Guns. Yes, please. Library. <laughs> oh, this is cool. You get to see what they do. Oh, man. Okay. I shouldn't be as excited about that as I am, but like the idea of getting to try it before I buy it. Scanners. These devices can help you find things. Go where the lights blink faster. I don't have any money. How do I get money? Can you tell me that? Wait, no. Wait. Talk to me. What, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh shit, he's pissed. Hello. Oh, shit. What? What just happened? What just happened? Wait. You. You. What's, what's that thing that dropped? What? The noises. Money. Okay, this game is fucking adorable. Bombs. This, this cute little girl is just standing here selling bombs. <laughs> Reset puzzles. Take one of you. Ah. 
I love that these little squares talk. He's a Filipino vlogger who keeps teasing Asus to give him a laptop. He did that for months. Asus gave him the laptop just recently. Holy hell. <laughs> he was like, now I can edit videos and finish them sooner. Proce proceeds to play PUBG, and his brother plays Dota 2 on it. <laughs> This is fun. Oh, I need something to like blast that. These guys do a blast, but I don't know if it's like explosive. Yeah, I didn't think so. It was like more concussive. Let's go in here. Oh shit. Oh, oh. Did I just kill somebody? I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I really didn't mean to do that. Oh god. I'm a monster. Oh, I should have used that to get up there. I, maybe I can... do everything I could do in the library. I got teleported out of there before I understood what happened. I like doing pills. The village. There's so many things you can buy in the village. But you won't find a lot of money here. Go explore. While carrying a bird, press the use button to repeatedly fly. The yellow birds are however terrible flyers. Hey, where'd all my money go? I have no idea, but I totally agree with you. Bring a blue or red bird. What do these guys do? You're a blast. Oh, I'm supposed to bring a bird in here. Okay. Never mind. Bring a gun. I don't have any money anymore. I died. It makes no sense.
Oh, damn it. All the way to the left again so we can figure this out. Or try to anyhow. Wait, I want, I want that. How do I get that from? No, I want that. It's mine. 60 more quotes and I have completed my list. Blood for the blood god. Oh. Oh, look at that. There we go. You scare me. None of you talk. I don't... Well, and no one blinks. Why does no one blink? <laughs> They're all just wide-eyed. Like, why? <laughs> I like how they did this. You have a whole room. Here's credits. <laughs> Bring items in the inventory. Read this book. Ah. All right, to the top right of the screen is your inventory. D-pad up, left, right, and down in cursed areas. You cannot put items into it, but you can always take things out. <laughs> so we did E already. By throwing an item downward, you can jump a second time while you're still in the air. <laughs> Birds, gems. Wait, hold on. So can I take that gem that's on the top there? I can. <laughs> I need to bring a bomb into that room. How do I get over there? You can throw carried items. Gotcha. gotta pay for a gem does that make sense convert gems into coins by using them when you die you lose all your coins yeah I figured that one out the hard way I don't think I have this guy yet nope I have not collected him yet So we had one that said I needed to bring a bird. Convert your cash into, cash into the gems. <laughs> we got yellow birds and we got a blue bird. I don't have enough for the blue birds. I need a blue bird. I need money. So let's just go get a bomb so that we can do that other one. relatively cheap. Oh shit. Damn it. No, now I got to ruin the 7. Okay. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. I think I 
messed this all up. Really? I can't go in there with a bomb. Fuck me. Oh, I could have put it in my inventory. Oh, I stopped it from going. Aha! I'm figuring this out. Very, very slowly, but I'm figuring it out. The downside now is I'm running out of gems. Not sure what to do with that. There was one that said bring a gun. So let's bring a gun. Don't remember which one said bring a gun. Was it P? It might have been P. Yep, it's the bird. Maybe it's H. I like it. Wait a minute. Nope. Nope. Haha. -ha. I feel like I just keep saying haha. -ha. <laughs> Might as well just start saying huzzah. Wait, wait, wait. We can put stuff in our inventory. You cannot put guns in your inventory. Okay, good to know. Good to know. No, oh, the room was cursed. No inventory. Ah, thank you. I did not notice that. Good looking out. H is in the top left. I am really liking this game. It's so quirky. So we need a I need more money. That's really what this has come down to. I just need more money. I looked for a laptop at Amazon. It cost six hundred ninety nine, and then shipping it here would cost around two hundred three dollars. Jeez. Yes. We need more money. Always need more money. Oh. Oh, okay. Yep, we're gonna take him. Because I can't. Oh, what? I'm, he's one of the next ones I gotta get. I love their talking voices. <laughs> Gain seven. That's still not enough. Do you have another wife? I want to meet that bitch. <laughs> It was a good stream.
All right, all right. Gaining some money. All right, so, so far tonight, I think we found, I definitely think we found some really good games. Ow, ow. No, I had money. <laughs> <laughs> it's all gone. I had like 15. It's all gone. <sighs> that hurts. I think we found a few. Time recoil was really, really cool and totally surprised me. Ow, fuck you. Um, I personally really enjoyed... Um... The other one. Oh, and there goes that one. Um, Tangle Deep. I think that'll be another fun one. Uh, I knew I was going to like a robot named Fight. And then this game, man. I don't even know what the fuck this is. But I'm in love with it. Heal? Oh, we will put you in the inventory. <laughs> I like that. Stop it. She just took my... Stop take... No! Stop that. Oh no! without another you no oh. all Shit. Oh god, you have to sacrifice something. <laughs> That's how that works. Oh, this thing's not good at flying. I really do hope this game has a soundtrack. Oh my god. I'm in love with it. Oh. 
Oh, hell yeah. Oh, there's so many, so many guys that have gone back. talking about noisy lobsters. That game, <laughs> that game is something else, right? <laughs> Holy shit. Well, thank you, everybody. I think I'm going to wrap it up here. Thank you, everyone, for coming out tonight for my little indie, my little indie game mixer. Um, I think we found some really good games here. Uh, Ernog is just adorably good confusing and I love it <laughs> um, I really enjoyed Tangle Deep and absolutely loved what was the other one we played god what were all the games we played tonight just so that I can cover in my mind Robot Name Fight was fun Time Recoil that's right Time Recoil fucking Time Cop meets uh, Hotline Miami Tangle Deep was awesome. This was amazing. Ernog is <laughs> something else, right? That is, I've had a blast tonight. Um, I will put the links to each of these games in Discord so that everyone, if you are interested, can grab them or wish list them. Uh, shout out to everybody that came out tonight. So, Rust Devil, thank you. Phoenix Hero, thank you. Bio Kirby, thank you. And a shout out for God of Knockers. Thank you so much for the follow earlier. I do appreciate it. So with that, everyone, I thank you once again. I am now a Humble Bundle partner. So any purchases you guys plan to make through Humble, be it getting the getting Humble Monthly, if you're going to sign up for that, or any single little purchase, um, Think about consider using my affiliate link it helps support this channel um, you can choose how much you want to support I think it's up to 15% there's a slider it can vary depending on the kind of sale uh, I will be putting that also in my discord so that you guys can see uh, I've always enjoyed humble bundle I think I always post most of their sales when I get a chance to so now I'm just gonna be adding my link into it so that way you guys can help support the channel help me get my PC a little quicker <laughs> well thank you guys I hope you all enjoy the rest of your mornings afternoons and evenings I will see you guys tomorrow good night